much. We're firing right back here. Um, you gotta right. put the uh, gerbils back on the hamster wheel. Yeah, exactly. Okay. That's the only way this thing works. All right, we got Dan above here, kind of pelting down a little bit. Out of position, sort of, maybe if they're able to make something happen. Maybe but not. He's just Ooh. trying to get in there. Low ground, maybe. Steal some damage. They really Sneak want back. to stop him right here, but no one's been able to hold this point. I don't, yeah, I, what is what is happening here? Why are we not able to see that point they, held at all? They both gave up on it. Notice that slow transition from that other team. They're already responding to the bottom here, and they're already up past this ridge. That's a problem. You need to be responding much earlier if you want to have a chance to actually prevent that push. If you don't get there soon enough, you're on equal ground, and it's anybody's match at that point. That's not what a defensive team wants to be in. But you know what? They're able to push it back right here. They're not going to allow them to move through here. We got a big res here, potentially from Link. Let me get you but he doesn't need it. He's keeping everybody up. Water's able to hold. So that was a really close one for Team Earth here. They were pushing through like they were before, but it just wasn't enough. We've got Xave trying to fly around a little bit. We've got a big Rhine ult. They've got a minute and a half left to make something happen here. Ooh, the Mercy goes down. That's really bad for for Team yeah, Water. That's yeah. going to inhibit their ability to push through here. Or, I'm sorry, to stay alive while uh, Team Earth pushes through. We've got Xave coming around the back. Really strong play here. This Mercy is just keeping everybody up. Really strong. They're pushing in a minute. They're going to be looking at uh, doing some overtime pushes, but, you know, once you're in overtime, anything can happen. And Link pops the res, tries to prevent them from getting this. We're going to see if it pays off, but... I, I mean... I mean, I'm kind of rooting for water here because I want to see him do a big win after last week, actually. But where's it? Go to, uh, I kind of want to see what, what their damage dealers are doing here on uh, on Earth. Where, where are they at? Sure. We're going to focus on here. Yeah. He's kind of flying around. He's been really good about picking his targets, figuring out who's going to take him out, and really punishing him. He sees that McCree up there. But you know what? Again, this is what it's, the team did against Earth last time that was very effective. And I think actually Dan was part of this. And I wonder if he's been kind of working with his team to do this. They recognize that Xave is one of the strongest players on another team. Mm -hmm. What do you do against a strong Pharah? He gets some hit scan. That hit scan is going to shut him down. And you notice he's not as damaging as he was before. Right there. Central wow. picks him up. Red's coming in. Got a red. Yeah, because we got that was dangerous. Oh, that, yeah, that was really risky. Don't want to be moving that way. That way yeah. But Nightmare comes in and finishes him off. We're in overtime right now, so right now this payload needs to stay with people on it. We're staying on down. it. We got halftime going, going, going. Dan cleans them off, Bam. and that's the end of it. Wow. Really good play. Really good play. So they made it pretty far there. Yeah, I, I want to see if they can roll, if they're able to come back here and roll it right under that bridge again, or if they can hold it. I really think that's going to be the key to who wins this. Absolutely. If you can hold that bridge, you can definitely, definitely hold this map. Hold the bridge, hold, hold the win. Yeah, yeah, something like that. All right, as our, st our stream is back still up, up. I'm right. on, uh, yeah, that's a lower quality connection there. So. No, that's no problem. All right, here we go. Uh, Kawhi Senpai back on heels again. These teams are definitely pretty consistent with what they got, but you know what you see? We've got our Bastion play coming in with Dan. Worked from last then. Yeah. They weren't stopped though. Yeah, I think they're going to go with that same build here. Although, did they have... No, they did do Mercy. That's right. Yep. Okay. Yeah, that's the same. This is a strong build. They knew that Team Earth wasn't able to stop them. Yep. They walked pretty much right through them. So, if Earth doesn't set up... See, no, but now they have the Pharah. That's the change. Yeah. No, that... Well, yeah, you're right. Yeah, so, they didn't start. So, I want to see if they position Pharah here correctly and take out Bastion and shut Dan down, then they have an opportunity here. Absolutely. Be an exciting moment here. We're gonna see what they're able to do. So I know a lot of players have issues playing against Bastion. Would you say you're one of those players? Uh, actually, not as fair. I don't. I don't have a problem. When I'm playing tank, I get shut down. But I'm also not a very good Ryan player, so that might show. So they did make some changes to Bastion. Yeah. So you notice that spread right there makes him not so good against Yeah. Yes, correct. Which is nice. But you know what? He's deadly against most anybody else. 
Right now, this team's staying patient. Dan's just, it's not working like it was yeah, last see, time. Yeah, see there, now he's off the payload. And see Farrah right there. Right there, you can see it going right after him. We're going to see, you notice they're down there earlier. Teams are yep. burning, working on it. This Junkrat can really do some damage there, but again, yeah. you got to get in. you got to make something happen. Well, that no, Diva he's doing it right. He's right in that pocket there. He's shutting him down slowly. He's got to watch that Farrah, though. Watch that Farrah as she sees it. They're doing it. They're doing good. Yeah, that is good. Wow. Impressive. So really good hold here. This time yeah. it did not work, this which is did, cool. Yeah. Dan just not able to make anything happen there in this Bastion play. So I want to see. I'm anxious to see if Dan's going to switch it up here and go another damage dealer instead of Bastion, though. Let's see what he does. So no, he's going to stick it again. He's okay. got 50% to his ult. He, he does, knows that, throw that away. the yeah. ult can be really strong on Bastion at this point. You just pound right through. That's what they're banking on. And to be honest, they got a lot of time. They got three and a half minutes. They're good. They're probably like collect themselves. Look, look, there they are grouping up. They're collectively going in. No trickle happening here. That shield, though, getting shredded. Ryan is just not had a lot of difficulties against Sebastian when they're not getting focused. That shield again, down again. Ryan is just kind of sitting duck at this point. Now they're starting to push in pretty aggressively. And he's got to back up. Link's got his ult up as well. We're going to be looking at looking at Team Water push through it. Oh, pop the res early. They want to keep this push going as much as possible. Dan ulting through but getting bounced back by Roadhog. Really smart play there. And again, that damage is so strong. Wow, came in a really yeah. nice job there. And we still got some ults left, so it could be devastating. How's the lag now, Oak Weaver? Has it improved at all? Because I'm showing we're good right now. All right, big alt. Pushing through, preventing this from happening. We're backing up a little bit here. We got some big ults, they just need to make it past this bridge, and they still, again, have a lot of time, but like we've seen... And they can move it here if they if they coordinate right. Absolutely. We've seen that they're not always able to... You know, the timer goes quick. You know, sometimes you feel like you got two full minutes, but sometimes it's just not enough. Really trying to hold that high ground. Ooh, nice pick right there. Excellent. Waiting for, ooh, oh, nice good shot. Air shot. That's gonna keep it nice. Down. Got our healers trying their best. They know that they're Anna, under pressure here. Anna knows this is gonna be it right here. Trying to get some kills on that ferret. Oh, it's right after that. Takes a fair. couple shots. It's just three and she's down. That one gives me the most trouble. <laughs> We're gonna have our all up on Anna there trying there to do go. something. It was a little out of position, but we have to get back. Ooh, they're throwing a lot at him. That ult's gonna catch him. Good ult by Tremulus there. Keeps him down, and this is looking like wow. Team Water is gonna make it through. Nice wow. job. Wow. Game with a minute and a half left to spare. That was nice. All right, so we got Water. That was the first win for Water, if I'm correct, yeah? Oh. All right, so really good plays there. I, I don't know, who are we yeah. gonna get for play of the game here? We got Tremulous, Tremulous. might have been this ending alt here that really wow. uh, shut him down. Yes, it is, right here. Just gonna launch that over, catch a couple kills, really smart play there. Nice. Picking up some great kills, running them down. Excellent work. Do you wanna get this to Tremulous and I'll fire up the next game? Yeah. yeah.